You know, it's not often that a restaurant gets to celebrate its 100th anniversary, but for Phillips Seafood, that's exactly what they're getting to do. After opening a small commercial fishery on Chesapeake Bay 100 years ago, and then a crab shack in Ocean City, Maryland in 1956, this business has grown into multiple restaurants in multiple states. Today, Eat This is visiting their location in Atlantic City, where we're gonna see fresh seafood being made, and we're gonna get to do some tasting. I'm Chuck Thomas, and it's time for Eat This. You know, when the folks at Phillips Seafood invited me over to Atlanta City to try some of their seafood, I, I was pretty excited. I mean, I mean, aside from giving me a free 100th anniversary cookbook, I've had the opportunity to uh, have them make something. Like, I'm starting off my day with their ultimate crab cake, and Phillips is uh, definitely crab, huh? Mm. <laughs> There's no filler to that. That's good. Let's see what Chef Paul's doing all the seafood he's making back there. Let's go check it out. I came from England in 1980, moved to Atlantic City in 1984. When I left there, I was the executive chef and I came to Philip Seafood Restaurant. From my experience, from being a chef on the line or whatever, you're so busy and you've had a great experience. It's customers who enjoy themselves and you say, wow, what a great night we've had. You know, I, I love seeing repeat customers. I'll sit down and chat with them. And if they only come four times a year, but you have to remember that face. Say, it's great to see you back here. So I'm hoping to see you back here, Chuck. But before we get to that featured dish, I want to show you well the signature salad they have there, as well as crab macaroni and cheese. They use both provolone and cheddar cheeses in that dish. Also, they make an incredible grilled salmon with sautéed jumbo lump crab, and that's served on a bed of chorizo zucchini hash. Mmm. So I'm back in the kitchen with Chef Paul Drew. He's the corporate chef for Philip Seafood Restaurants, and he's going to be preparing our main dish today, and that is the Philip's clam bake for two. Chef, <laughs> that is a spread of seafood oh. there. One dish? Just one dish is good for two people. What, what a great meal. What all's meal. going into it? So we have snow legs, mm -hmm. corn, white potatoes, two lobsters. Wow. Half a pound of shrimp. A lot of shrimp. Mussels. Love mussels. And clams. clams. Middle neck clams. Nice. And all that's going into one pot. One pot. For two people. For two people. That's a lot for even two people to share, I think. I think so. And so you've got it all in the pan. What happens first with this? What we do is we put it in, obviously in this pan and then we put it into our steamer. Then after about 15 to 16 minutes, Chef Paul pulls the fresh seafood out of the steamer. The back. So you always build from the back to the front. And I noticed you have equal amounts of each seafood, so there's no arguing at the table. Oh yeah, we don't want that arguing <laughs> at the table. <laughs> no, no, we want everybody happy. I can't believe you're fitting it in there. Uh, it's a little That's tight, a, isn't it's it? A, it's a balancing act, but you're doing a great job, Chef. And then the shrimp, right on top of that. And a little parsley for color, and then melty butter. And so you call this the Phillips Clam Bake for two? Yes. I'm calling that the Phillips Mountain of Seafood. But I have to be honest with you, I think I could eat all that by myself. I really do. Well, you're going to have to try. You're going to have to. <laughs> I'm going to try. In fact, let's go out in the dining room and... Uh, I'm going to sample something here. Absolutely. Thanks, Chef. Thank you. So, Chef, we saw how you make this uh, Phillips clam bake for two, which looks like clam bake for four, but uh, I guess there's only one thing left to do, and that's uh, take try, a taste. Right. Absolutely. All right. Phillips known for crab, so I'm starting there. A little dip in the butter. Mmm. How is that? Is there is there any bad crab? No. No, there's no such thing as bad crab. <laughs> That's excellent crab. And well, what thank you. an impressive dish, really. Yes. Um, chef, thank you for inviting us into your restaurant. Beautiful place, excellent seafood. And folks, Atlantic City, way more than just a gaming gambling destination. This is a restaurant destination and Philip Seafood, definitely one of the places you want to hit when you visit here. I, aside from this dish, all the other ones we've shown, you can't go wrong. Well, thank you. Until next time, I'm Chuck Thomas. I'm going to eat more of this. I'm probably be eating this all afternoon. I'll help. <laughs> Good. Thanks, Chef. <laughs>